Yo, what is up, everybody? Good night. We are here to yes. play The Devil in Me. More of this game. Um, we started out, it was kind of rough the start. I'm not gonna front. And then it picked up, and then it got really good. So, where we left off at, um, Shira Thanks for just. The sub, Alejandro. Here for the scrumptious yams. And thank oh, you so God. much for the thumbnails. Um, Shira, fun. what did you do? You saved Charlie from getting cooked in the, in the chamber. Everybody's still alive. We still have to figure out what Jamie was doing in that whole situation where she um, told Aaron to go hide in the, in the cabinet because we still don't know what that was about. That was a really weird segment. I hope they circle back to that um, so we get some answers. It's my go. It should be yeah. my turn because the last thing we did was with Charlie and then the chapter ended and I was like, all right, this is a perfect place to stop. And we plan on finishing this out tonight. So grab your popcorn, your snacks, whatever. Grab your Sunny D. Some of y'all trying to talk mess about Sunny D we saw in that reaction at one time whatever you feel like drinking you drink that because we're going to finish this out tonight it's going to be a good time hopefully everybody's alive by the end of it so all right wait it's Shira's go yes I told you it was me that's so weird okay um all right cool wow these don't these these buttons don't work that's just sweet Whatever. Yeah, Capri said until you find mold at the bottom of your pouch that she can't see. <sighs> Capri Sun until you find mold at the bottom of your pouch. It was happening. That you can't see. Oh, it is Shira's turn. Would you look? Would you just look at that? Would you look at it? Somebody come and look at this. Come and just look at that. There you go. Ready? Pick up the stick, son. Because it was my mother at some turn. You're right. I don't even remember what the controls are. All right, champ. Oh, okay. Oh, God. Charlie, oh, my God. The worst boss ever. I'm so sorry. I... I'm so glad he's I could have saved him. He's not dead, though. It's obvious he's not dead. What? <laughs> what the fuck? Wait. You hear that? Yeah. From down there. What if it's Aaron? No way. Damn it's it. It's another trap. It's the only way out of here. So, we're going to find out. Find a way out, Shira. Okay, or is this? Wait, go. Is this a good idea? I don't see any other options. I think the okay. I think the story jumped forward with Aaron, and then now going back, you're probably gonna help her out in this setting with um, mm. with Marcus and whatever her name is. Was her name Kate? Yeah. Where the hell are we? Dark is up in here. Bro, what? Why is it so dark? I'm, there you go. You're going, right You're going the right way. You're going the right way. You're going the right way. I just didn't want to miss anything on the floor. Oh, okay. They said, I guess they said we, we missed stuff. So, I'm just trying to do my diligence here. Oh, really? Somebody said if you go to the third toilet on the right, there's a poop in there. Why would I want to see that, though? They said there's an item Keep in there. Keep looking around. There's a dono. I can see it in my peripheral. There's two don't know, so I can see them yeah. in my peripheral. And I'm lying. Nobody said that in the chat. I just wanted you to go over to the toilet. I'm sorry. Um, thank you for the dono, McSeason. That guy's funny. Funny as fuck. Would you just look at it? Yes, he is funny. And thank you. Um, I don't know if it's I don't know if it's Hymon or Jamon. Hey, love you guys' channel. Will you guys do a reaction to the Naruto 20th anniversary video? Uh, we've seen it already. We're not gonna do a reaction to that. 
So hopefully whatever they're announcing is something fire though. Something useful around here. Like a gun? Watching us. Duh. Pop down. Okay. And don't forget, Jog is R is L one. Yes, I know. But I just don't want to miss things. You I won't. It's miss a bunch of crap. You'll be fine. It sparkles. Oh, I see. see. There's something over there. And there's something right here. It's telling you to climb. Oh. But go back. There's I something. I'm gonna go back. Oh, it's an animatronic. Right stick. It's telling you to use the right oh, stick. Right. Oh, yeah, that's right. That is what that meant. Oh. oh this way? One of the workers. Is that the one that was, like, saying everybody was disappearing? Yeah, I think so. You can't walk over there? No, I don't think so. All right, and crouching tiger, tiger hidden dragon right there. He's walking away anyway, so. Where are you going? Up. Go to the wall. No point just standing around. Jump. Oh, I thought it was gonna have me do the little ledge slide. I thought so too. Thing. Dear all, please note that due to ingressive water from the laundry room, the ceiling through to the boiler room has collapsed, causing significant damage to plant machinery and water supply. In the circumstances, we have taken the difficult decision to close the spa with immediate effect until a repair can be made, which can be some months. Damn. Empty room? Okay. So I can't, I can't. No, it's boarded up. Oh, okay. 
There must be something useful around here. Alright, I guess I gotta go back. Jump back with Ross. <laughs> Is there okay? Turn the camera, look across the way. What are you doing? And how do you, how do you get over there? This way. Yeah. He was in the way over here. Yeah, but you can't go that way. I know I can't. How about I was just seeing if there was. I guess I gotta go up and then around that way. Yeah, go over there. <sighs> Climb back up and go to the right. <laughs> no, is that shit blocked? Yeah, it's what the blocked. hell? take the ladder up oh no no you don't okay i guess we just missed that you can go left so go back to where you were yep no point just standing around left. yep <laughs> sir See, how did you get over there Staircase is blocked. Bro. <laughs> she can't make this jump? Like, right no, here? No, but that. If, uh, make that jump for what? It's blocked over there. Oh, yeah. That's true. I guess he just climbed up the F. Keep looking there. around. Look at the body again. And then look around. Oh, is that the only thing there? Okay, yeah, never mind. Just it was head back. Just this. Okay, so I guess you just have to go back to that room. There's just something in there you haven't seen. Something for the oh, right there. Okay, you can go in between there. Okay, we walked in front of it instead of yeah. behind it. Is that like a recording from when they were shooting? I guess so. Because otherwise, why would she be saying that? Um. 
Oh, what the? Always crouching, bro. Hop over that X. <laughs> Should look around first before going this way. Sweet. So you, hmm. Go back and inspect that body. And then use R to look around. Like, is there anything on him? Nope. Okay. I think it's showing how all the other workers like died. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think so too. Ooh. Okay, yeah, no, you can this. Oh, go left. There's a door back there. Yeah, right oh, there. Okay. Then it just opens up the shortcut. Or not. Nope. Oh, what the hell, bro? I think that's the narrator of the story. Could be. Yeah, hop up there. Obviously. Oh, wow. That scared the hell out of me. Yo, what the fuck just happened? All right. Thank you for the dono, Lime and Lemon. Just finished your God of War Ragnarok VOD, the one where you finished the story. It was so fun watching you beat the game and watching Roshi in particular struggle with every possible puzzle in said game. Thank you. You're very welcome. You're welcome. I can't see anything. Yeah, it's mad dark. Think that was him? Yeah. Keep looking around. I think you better stop all that shuffling and shit back there. It's gotta be a way through. Yeah, if I could effing see. Oh. It's the way through is through the sink. Yeah, but I found the coin next to the sink. Alright, I think it's... Next. I think you're going the right way. Left. Turn around. Stop looking at the floor. This 
is where it just came from, no? Yeah, but I said left and then you went your own way. That was left. I was saying left doesn't turn around and go left well, over there by a, the pipes. Well, left could mean a lot of different things. No point just standing around. I went left. You said left. I went left. There's nothing here. It's blocked. Can you climb up on that? That's what I was gonna do. Or is that the way we just came from? Um, I don't know. I can't tell. Everything looks the same. No, it's not where we just came from, I don't think. No. Okay, there you go. There must be a way out. <laughs> what if Shiro would have fell and she would have died? <laughs> yeah. Yo, that would have been gold. I would have been okay with it. I would have been like, hey, that's Did this shit just... happens. Climb back up on that box next to you. The pallet. To, to your right. To your right. what I just did. No, climb up. There must be something useful around here. Yes, this is literally what I just sure did. Up. It's a whole different pallet. Okay. Sit go across the wall now. Okay. I'm sorry, all these areas look the same. Because you're looking at the floor. Sir, what is wrong with this guy? Why are you making all that fucking noise, bro? You can't do this quietly? No, you cannot do this quietly. Mark, give me a hand moving this shit. I'm over. Okay. I am. Just had to get my nerves together. Listen, don't be stalling. Shut up. Oh wait, look oh, at that, look at that. Don't oh, shut up. Oh, two workers. He, they were like his test subjects. Yeah, fucking saw. Yeah, they were like his All right. test subjects. Wait, push the red button, push the red button. Don't, don't leave without pushing that. Oh. Against a whole sir? A whole ma'am against a whole sir. Did you just assume their genders? Yeah. Is that what you just They're did? They're mannequins, so I assume. Is that what you did in front of like. Yeah, see, Ryan, that's it. I assumed right. So you just assumed his gender? Sir, cut it out. <laughs> they said Hiroshi go. <laughs> Uh, Chris Kidd, yes, Shira is playing. She has characters and I have characters. It's just not my turn. Am I distracting you? They said I'm distracting you. No. Shut your mouth. Hmm. 
right, so we're gonna need that key. Use it. Go back. Go back. Oh, we got the key. Hey, <laughs> just kidding. You gotta hit right on the D-pad. Who the fuck is that? Wait. That's, that's our friend. That's Kate? Oh. Yeah, that's Kate. It like she had a bowl cut for a second. I was like, who is that? So you're just not going to call out to her? It didn't Mark, give me the option. Here. No, that's what I'm saying. Like, the character's the just not going to be like... I guess she didn't see her. <laughs> Mark? Jamie? Here. Kate. We're okay. We're okay. Thank God. To her. We found a key. Let's get out of here. Oh no, that wasn't the narrator. That was literally him walking around. Hear that? This way. I have no idea what these numbers are for. I'm just writing them down just in case some stupidness come oh, up. This is your person. You're probably gonna tell me to switch to you in a minute. <laughs> yeah. Get away from me. Where did you <laughs> switch? What? Well, why? Now there it is. Oh no. Why would you go into a clearly a room <laughs> with clearly no out? Because he funneled her there. Wait, no. Oh my god. What's wrong with the these people? Why do you keep going into random rooms? Ah. Oh, we all in a room too. Good. That door about to close. Oh, we have to pick. Erin, are you okay? Please say you're all right. Get me out of here! Hurry up! It's another trap! No! He has her inhaler. Yeah. These windows are welded in place. He fucking wants us to watch. Wait, look. Regulator switch. Oh, like the mayor? The... No. Not both of them. It's sucking out all the air. We have to choose who to give air to. Whoever we point this lever at is gonna die. What? Do something! He wants to choose, doesn't he? Oh my god. I can't like split it. I don't know, but she has her inhaler. I can't. If we don't do something, that got to count for something. Die, I don't Mark. know if that's how this works. I don't. That's medicine. That's not yeah, medicine. I know it's medicine, but this is a video game. They could be stupid when they made die. it. I don't want to die. Please help me. <laughs> they said Roshino. <laughs> we have to choose now. What yeah, if I you, do nothing? Then you don't, I mean, you don't have to pick. Thanks for the sub, Dr. Mingo. I can't breathe. 
I'm sorry, Aaron. I... I'm so sorry. I don't, I, I don't know what the fuck the outcome that was supposed to be. Well, there goes her. That was so I, weird. Jesus, Erin, she's, she's, she's gone. She's, she's fucking gone. Oh my God. Oh my God. I... I didn't know what to do. It's okay. You don't have to say anything. None of this is on us. This is all Dumet. He set us up. We need a plan. Forget his games, traps, all that bullshit. Think about the killers we've covered. There's always a weakness. Are you suggesting we invite him to tea and psychoanalyze? I'm suggesting we use our heads. We can make guesses all day, but if we die here, it won't matter. I'm not playing detective, I just want to survive. Playing detective is how we survive. We play his games, we'll lose. We need to outthink him. He's trying to pick us off one at a time. We need to stick together. Hang on. He could be listening to us right now. Where should we go? Back to the ferry. It left, remember? It's on the line, maybe we could reel it in. Maybe it isn't good enough. The lighthouse. Maybe we can signal for help. There's police boats patrolling the lakes, right? All the way out here? Lighthouses are meant to be seen for miles. Are you shooting any of us? No one is going to believe it without proof. Bitch, you nobody want me wants... to record him trying to kill us? What? bodies? For the cops. Oh. <laughs> he said <Hear> that. that. <laughs> the walls are moving again. Okay, hang on. We need to stay close. Shit! Kate! Hang on! Ah! 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 <laughs> oh, what? Uh, there's a booby trap. Jamie! Why would they not stay together? Wait, no, no, no! Clown world. They said that we could have saved both. I, I, I guess I thought about it after. I guess if you would have given. So I guess the way they wanted you to think about it was Aaron has asthma. Give her the air. And then if you would have given Aaron the air, the other one would have survived. Because clearly you didn't give either one of them any oxygen and Kate survived. She was fine. Yeah, but. The, it, I just think that that's kind of annoying because it's not save Aaron or save Kate. It's kill Aaron or kill Kate. Mm, so yeah. I feel like that's a terrible, like, that's a terrible. And then, I, At least that's how I interpret it. And then some it. people are saying Kate had a weak window. How am I supposed to have you know she had a weak window? <laughs> Kate's window had a leak? Like, how am I supposed to know that, though? It said Kate's room wasn't sealed properly, so it always has air. How am I supposed to know that? Wait, yeah, how, wait. It's literally a 50-50 guess at that point. There was no way in that amount of time that you have, like, The game showed a, the game showed a crack in the window. Yeah, in this old-ass house, I'm supposed to know that that means that she's fine? Yeah, that, that was terrible. Wow. Whatever, whatever. <laughs> so, me thinking... Me thinking, oh, yeah, she has oxygen. Just, I guess, give her the air is not the answer. It was because she had a crack in the window. It wasn't sealed. All right. <clears throat> oh, my God. <laughs> hey, yo, that could have been it for you, bro. No, that comes in clutch because it grabs. Oh, never mind. That was weird animation. Like, he died. <laughs> Spider senses. Yes. That would have been it for the camera. It's 
some people are saying they also didn't see the the crack like that was yeah. poorly poorly done like i don't care what anyone says there's a jillion cracks in this building. i don't think anybody's <coughs> i don't think anybody's denying the fact that that was bullshit they said so i chose to kill both no i chose to do nothing because sometimes nothing yeah is sometimes doing answer. nothing is the correct answer They said they show the crack after you make the choice. <laughs> so you literally have to take a wild guess. But again, I guess they were hoping that you would bet on um, old girl with the asthma. Yeah, they say the crack isn't shown until after. Okay. So I guess in your retry, your replay, quote unquote, you would know like, oh, there was a crack there. We could have. But is that the other one. is that really fair though? That's not really fair. Yeah, I know. Y yeah, that's... That's the narrator. No, that's not. That's the dude. Oh, it is the dude? Yeah, the narrator dude is only hidden in the game. This is oh, actually the murderer. okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He has a mask on. For real? For real? For real? Oh. I think he's gone. Listen, I don't trust it because I'll let go of this damn button and he'll just be like, whoa, whoa what? I think he's gone. I think you're gonna have to crouch, like, at times. Oh, there's Oh, some yeah, there we go. Odorless paint thinner. Ah, paint thinner, that takes me back to the days of Parasite. Isn't that what she threw on the parasite paint thinner? When mm -hmm. she when she was like, "Hey, meet me in math class." Yes. Mhm. Mm oh wow. Bro, let me move. Bro. I would have seen that nigga under the table. Ooh, I almost hit a button on mistake. This thing gives me so much anxiety. Only because we screwed it up that one time. Well, I screwed it up that one time. And all the noise makes it even harder. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Nigga, wh why would you go touch that? Loud as F. Right. I know I hear you. I know he hear him. Ain't no way he don't hear him.
Damn, bae. He's waiting to get some parts. He wants her skin to fill in oh. the little patches of skin. Hang on. I see another random number. I'm going to just write it down. 7293. Oh. Uh, They've probably been on every mannequin. <laughs> we just ain't noticed them. Yeah, but that's weird. Yeah, see? 72. 93. Interesting. Mama said, I get caught because he smelled my pants full of shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> that's disgusting. <laughs> zero, zero, two, eight. Yeah. The bar one is zero, zero, two, eight. So hers. These numbers might not have no significance. But make but sure you what? put that seven, two, nine, three is Kate's. Yeah. And that bar, one is bar. Bar nigga. That's what I put. Can I? Is this one have a number? Nope. Or wait. Y yeah, you just bring it back to this dude's face. Am I supposed to like take a picture of this room? Let's see. That footage ain't gonna make it anywhere, no way. Well, I haven't taken pictures of anything. We give it to the cops? Okay, so it's just a bunch of mannequins. <laughs> Ooh. Why would they do that? There's a glimmer right there, too. I know, I've seen it. Six, eight, eight, three. Sixty eight, eighty three. Who is that on? I, I don't know. That was oh, just a that was random part. Teeth. Oh, the teeth he took off of that human. Remember? Yeah. Is there a number on it somewhere? And then the those are the ears off of the other body. Remember, he yeah. said little bleeding clean. Cut. And they're like, oh yeah, that was impressive. Man, I wish I was a serial killer. Look at that clean cut. They did a good job. He's learning. That's pretty much how that went. Stop! Don't you you but set don't me let up. It go, but don't I let didn't it go. let it go. You made me let it go. You said I wasn't holding it. I'm literally holding the button. You set me up. So then you let it go? If you're holding the button? It sure almost got me clapped just now. But My. you let go of the button. Why? <laughs> because you were saying it like I wasn't holding it. You made me second guess myself. <laughs> holding the button <laughs> sure over your pet what are you doing hide what are you what are you doing oh man
I need to look at this for? A drill bit? Okay. Oh, what? Did he just make a weapon out of it? I think so. There we go. <laughs> okay, this nigga about to get killed, bro. He's thinking back to his DP days. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, with a drill bit, though? Bitch, I'm not pressing Press shit. Okay. Press the button. I'm not pressing nothing until I know what's around here. Is that a closed room? I can't tell if that's just his jacket on a mannequin, though. No, that's him. Look at his hands. It looked like a mannequin hand to me. That shit don't look like. Thanks for the sub, Larry. You didn't make it to that premonition, so that's not gonna happen. No, they said not nah, his hands dark as hell. <laughs> look at it again. Yeah. This don't look like no Vatican hands to me. Wait, what? <laughs> that's how she could have just died so many ways, clearly. Yeah. That's cool. Okay. Press the button. Press the button. Press the button. Press it. Gotcha. Press the button. Press it. Press the button. Can you press inspect the him button. first? No, no, I can't look. I can't. Press the button. Press Somebody's yelling at you to press the button. Because they can see you. Press the button. Press the button! Press the button! Press it! Press oh, that's probably button. what his body looks like. He's Press probably it. all mangled. Press the button! Press Nothing the button! No, no, I can't look. Nothing Press the button! Press the button, please! Goodness! <laughs> Can I back out? Press the button. I don't trust that. Press the button! Press the Do you have to? Bro, I think you have to to proceed. What is that on the floor? I already picked that up just now. Oh, oh. Bro, I'll press that shit if nothing bad happens. Just go this way. See what's this way first. I came from that way. Oh. All right, fuck it. We ball. Press it. Got you. Ah! Oh, they wanted us to press the button. Nineteen eighty nine. Hector Monday. Was that him out there? Well, there's no way his body parts would still look like that after that many years, like thirty plus years. You got the security code? I'ma just try one of these numbers. Wasn't it the first one? Isn't it the same one? The 0451 or whatever. Now I'm trying one of the numbers we found in here. Oh, that was right.
Oh, wow. Nowhere. That's it? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, no, I get it. I oh, get each it. mannequin's each footage. Each mannequin's footage. Let me try something real quick. Nope. Okay. Nope. Okay. All right. So now we have the mannequins. So the first numbers that we saw going up and down the stairs, uh, those haven't amounted to anything. Oh, him oh, going yeah. crazy over the cigarettes. His... Yeah. Oh, wait. We can see him creeping up. Yes. Yes. Does he disappear? Yeah, you deleted the footage, sir. What was that? It's just water dripping. I thought I saw a glimmer. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, right here. Right there. Welcome, new recruits, FBI. I'm guessing that's Hector Monday, whose face is scratched out. Oh, must have been a case of the Mondays. Yeah. Psychological assessment conducted by Dr. Isabella Garcia. Patient name, Monday, Hector. Behavioral observation. Hector arrived at our scheduled appointment 24 minutes late. Once we sat down and began the session, he struggled to maintain eye contact. He found it difficult to articulate his feelings and subway. was terse and guarded throughout. Hector has been working long hours and as a result, isn't sleeping well. Hector spoke about his recently deceased mother and displayed evidence that he hasn't yet fully come to terms with her death. I strongly recommended a course of antidepressants, but he is resistant to this idea, believing that it would have a detrimental effect on his capability with regards to his current investigation. Hector describes his work in immaculate detail, and contrary to earlier in the session, his thought content is both coherent and logical. He is displaying an unhealthy obsession with his work. But his recent bereavement may be the underlying mm. issue. Interesting. Oh, cool. Dead end. <clears throat> You just gonna leave evidence that you just went through the vent, bro? You're not gonna try to at least like put it. He figures he. Oh my gosh. Uh, no. He figures he can see everything, so you know. Oh, 
Oh, what the fuck? Yo, I'm not some fucking lab rat here for your amusement. Well, obviously you are. How is he? Now what? How is he doing all of this? It has to be more than one person. There's no way. Oh, have fun. Yeah. Have fun. I'm looking at all these arrows and my brain is just like Yes, and then these both go to there, right? No, why would you hit that one? Because they both go to this one. Okay. And then... Pop! Oh, you got it! Oh, okay. Look at this man selling. Okay. Look at this man selling on me. First try, too. Oh, no shit. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> go ahead and shimmy. Shira just made up for getting my character killed. Listen, you your input was also to do nothing. So I, I didn't say anything. I said doing nothing is also an option. I didn't say do nothing. I said, yeah, doing nothing. Not you said, do I have to pick one or can I do nothing? I was like, doing nothing is also an option. But you also didn't tell me there was a crack in the window, so neither because neither. <laughs> All right then. <laughs> so we both. Because I knew I knew there was a crack in the window. I'm in there with Kate. But I'm Kate saying looked neither. At, I, but Kate I, looked at me and I'm was saying, like, "Hey, bro, there's a crack in the window." But I'm saying you're coming for me, but neither one of us knew there was. a I'm crack I'm not in the coming window. for you. I said you just made up for getting my character killed. Is that not? We the both truth? got your character killed. Okay, no. The game got your character killed. Because when I get a character killed, it's all gonna be on me. Watch. No, open the door. Open the door. I going? was just seeing if there was anything back here. Okay, that's fine. Please look in front of you. Huh? Pick the camera up. You can still see the floor when you look forward. I, yes. I, okay. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, your room got trashed? That's crazy. Now this is the lip balm we dropped. I think it like to stay right there. Oh, can you inspect the mirror? I will. No, I was saying, can you? I don't think so. Was the bed itself glimmering? Go look at the bed itself. No? Okay, it's just a lip balm. Okay. As far as I can tell. Yep, and then now you just gotta go to the same place where Kate was. Right there to your left. To my left? Oh, go back, go back. Make a right. And now on your right. Just go forward and turn right, turn right. There's a door. Right there. Oh, okay. The hell?
Okay, now she's gonna see it here, I think. Yeah, because of the hell aura coming from behind the mirror. There was something in front of you. Turn around. Don't leave the room. Turn around. Turn around. Turn, no, turn more to your right. More to my right. All the way around. Over there. Was there something shining over here? No. Oh, okay. It was, so just, was, it was just clipping. Okay. Her breathing is killing me right now. Go back down the hall. I mean, you're going in circles at this point. Everything's locked. Go check. And everything's moving around too. Locked. Locked. Okay, this so then. Oh wait, did you oh, shimmy wait. through there or no? Isn't that where I came from? Is yeah, that where you? This is where okay, I came yeah. From. So we'll go back. I will. So then it has to be in the room where she could see through the from behind the, the mirror. mirror. But I examined everything there. Just run back there. Yeah, Can you look around with R? There you go. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, that's all it lets me look at. Well, hold it on a certain spot because sometimes it lets you zoom. It sometimes she'll like they'll like zoom in and talk about it. No. Weird. Can you like L2 zoom in or something? No? No. You literally can't do nothing with that. Nope. Go look on the other side of the bed. Yeah, you didn't go over there. Nope. Okay, I guess you gotta shimmy back on through the wall and there's something over there. Okay, so go back. There was a to your right. A D-pad option. Was there? Oh, oh your screwdriver. Wow, I didn't even see that. I it had to be something with the mirror. I knew going back was gonna be futile. Oh, what the hell? Oh, wait. Oh, well, no. Mark! Bro, this plot hole in the game is gonna forever bother me until I'm done with the game. Go to the wall. There's a premonition right there. wouldn't the walls be able to squish though because i told you that they will probably could do that you're like no it was just the blueprints for just the walls moving and blocking hallways oh that's what you meant oh wait go in well first of all look at the camera
Jesus. There's cameras everywhere. They asked what plot hole. The plot hole of Jamie telling Aaron to get in the damn closet. How did she see her? Why did we not experience that in the game? Like, we did not see that. We don't know what she was doing. Like, we don't know anything about it. She's like, oh, just trust me. And we're like, uh, okay. Okay, these are the rooms he's looking into. That's what it's showing me. Mm -hmm. Like the different rooms he's been watching. not Charlie. Are you sure? I'm positive that's not him. You want to know what it means to be a killer? You ever been to the art museum downtown? They got this painting by a guy, I forget his name, famous painter. He did portraits of slaughtered cows hanging on hooks. You take a normal person to a slaughterhouse, and they will puke their guts out. You make it into a painting, and suddenly it's art. There's no difference between the two. Not really. Don't look at me like that. You know I'm right. You get it. I know you get it. You got to do something that matters. Make people feel something they've never felt before. Shatter the illusion that any of us are really in control. Think of the most profound thing you've ever done. The most beautiful thing you've ever created. I was going to say have children. That's funny. It's, a, <laughs> it's a baby. It's nothing compared to watching the life bleed out of someone. To see the fear in their eyes. To feel them pawing at you for release. To hear them pleading, begging. That moment when someone realizes they are at their end. That's when you feel it. That's true art. That's sick, bro. That's what you have to be. An artist. A sculptor. An architect. I see the gleam in your eye, Agent Monday. You're not fooling me. Look! Ah, oh, look at you now, huh? Am I gonna be your first? Well, come on then, huh? I'm right here. This room is soundproof. You don't even have to wait for a plane to fly overhead. <laughs> So, are they trying to build up to this? Yeah, this is after they caught him. The guy was doing this to us, I guess. No, but no. Or is I'm this saying, Monday doing this to us? I think it's Monday doing it to us right now. Oh, not bad. Not bad at all. Their hands can feel good. Because it's revolving huh? a lot around him. But the blade makes for such a prettier picture. Uh, you've got potential, Agent Monday. If you truly want to be an artist.
I think it's po I think it could possibly be him. Because we keep finding all the FBI documents around the place around him and then The heartbeat shit? Yep. Ma'am, he saw you through the window. Oh, God damn, that was close. Bro, this nigga playing games, man. Please. <laughs> Please. You're getting spared. No, I'm not. I've had to do more than you. Oh, come on. <sighs> Of course, the power just keeps fucking going out everywhere, so I can't see with the damn house of the dragon filter on the game. Oh, but I was gonna tell you that that plot hole you were talking about, like how we got her to her, directed her into the closet, blah, blah, blah. Somebody said that that got them killed in the game because they thought it was a fake voice and they didn't listen to it. And they ran instead of hiding like you wanted to do and it got them killed. See, but how is that fair? Because there's nothing that leads you to believe. That's what I'm saying. That's why I was like, just listen. That's why me personally, I was like, just listen to it. It sounds like her. You know, like she's saying to just listen to her and to hide. So just hide. That's dumb. And then they just never circle back. So to I it. just got lucky in that part. But yeah, I guess that did get somebody killed because <laughs> they thought it was a fake voice. Yeah, let's just do a bunch of shit that doesn't really make any sense. That'll just throw everybody off. Because in like the quarry and stuff, when stuff like that happens, you end up playing through that or experiencing it with the other characters. You're like, oh, this is this part when this and this happened. Oh, wow. Who Clutch. says self-help books don't work? Oh, they stopped that wall from closing. The she book, stopped yeah. that wall from closing. Yeah. That's risky. You just fumble on the square push. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she gets squished right there. We were trying to investigate this crying for like three hours. I was gonna like say we never did hours. find this person crying, did we? Probably a tape recorder. Of course, it's a tape recorder. It's always a tape recorder. Somebody said they explain it in the director's cut, apparently. Hello. That's a that's Can an animatronic. Ma'am? Somebody said they could have explained that in the actual game that I have. In case you miss me, Michelle, morning, writing, 8 a.m. Requested to use the library or music lounge, so assume I'm in one of those. Lunch and family times at 2 p.m. Can we dine outside in the garden? Evening writing, 5 p.m. The bar seems like a good writing spot. Dinner at 9 p.m. Manny Sherman, the beast of Arkansas. By Joseph Morello. By Joseph Morello. Oh wow, he's so Joseph he Morello. Wasn't Dumet on the ferry. Yep, we well, we figured out that it wasn't Dumet. Yep. So he's like writing a book about him. Mm-hmm. We've seen that name on we've seen that name on another book. But honestly, I was glad to be leaving. They'd been nice folks, the stewards, real nice, both in their 70s now. Dad's still strong as an ox, having been a military man before moving to the town to settle and start a family. 
Mom was starting to get a little frail. You could tell she'd taken it the hardest. Mrs. Stewart made had made me coffee. She was functioning okay, but had a dead behind the eyes look. 26 years on, still living in that cocoon of numbness such devastation can bring. We talked a lot. They were at ease talking about anything. The night it happened, the cruel details, how they felt about him. It was just a fact of life to them. Their daughter had been murdered by a serial killer, and that was their world. That sounds really mean. Maybe use kinder words. I don't like the cocoon sentence. Is there a more relatable metaphor? Everything. It was a shock when they offered to show me Mary's room. I was apprehensive, but thanked them and agreed. It would be helpful to get an idea of the kind of girl Mary was. I followed Mr. Stewart. I could feel the toll that the, mur the murder had taken as we walked through the house and upstairs to Mary's room. Her husband didn't like to go into that room. Things were neat and tidy, but shabby. We walked over a beaten old carpet, past outdated wallpaper and paintings, mostly biblical, that were thick with dust. The strain and financial impact must have been huge. Mrs. Stewart hadn't worked since Mary's death. Again, sounds really mean. Can you not just say they had a rough time of it without being so descriptive? Maybe explain why did she find it difficult to face anyone? Okay, so he's writing the book and then um, it's like his editor is going over it mm -hmm. and just giving notes. Or he's writing notes to himself, but it, it does look like two different kinds of, of handwriting. handwriting. Yeah. Her schoolwork was stacked by her bed and her childhood toys and dolls were still displayed on shelves. What stuck out the most though was her uniform, still hanging on the front of the wardrobe ready for her shift at the diner the next day. Mary was a tiny girl, only 5'1", and weighed less than 100 pounds. She didn't stand a chance the night she was taken. I kept thinking about her room as I drove through the town. Milton would have been an unremarkable place in 1995, but it was close to lifeless now. Mostly boarded up buildings, the only opening shops were liquor stores which had bums outside them drinking at 11 a.m. It was as if the town had died when Mary did. Eventually, Milton faded in my rearview mirror as the image of Mary's uniform burned into my mind. Go hug Natalie right now, please. Oh, wow. Later the next day, I finally got back to our house, scrambling over a package set on our doorstep. A brown box I had no idea who it was from. I had Michelle ordered something. Curiosity took over and I hauled it inside. Opening it, I found an old tape recording along with a quartet of tapes. Mm. I listened to the first one, the voice unmistakable. It was Sherman. Nope. Oh, Michelle ordered something. Nope. The quartet is four. Yes. Uh, listen to the first one, the voice unmistakable. Mentioned their interviews. Hmm. Nope, not going in there yet. Oh, I looked at that already. All right. I guess that was everything in here and on the floor and on the bed. And that's where the crying's coming from. Thanks for the dono, eh? I gotta oh, play dying, dying light. light please. One day. Bethany. Bethany. That was probably the little girl's doll that was here. Yeah, they hurried up and took all their shit hey, there's and a left. Drawing. There's a drawing on the desk with a glimmer on it. What are you talking about? There's a drawing on the floor. But this is um, Dumet's room and his daughter's room. Everything's a, everything's a mess because they just took what they could and just bounced immediately. Mm -hmm. Oh, she's crying. Please stop crying, mommy. Please stop crying, mommy. Oh, wow. They made an animatronic of her mom. Mm -hmm. Beast body burgled. Arkansas Ar this week. The body of the so-called beast of Arkansas has been removed from its grave by suspected body snatchers. The infamous serial killer, whose real name is Manny Sherman, was executed earlier this month and his remains were buried at an undisclosed cemetery in Springdale, Arkansas. A senior police spokesperson for local law enforcement 
stated at a press conference, we believe this to be the work of serial killer obsessives and are pursuing various leads. We assume there are multiple suspects involved, but have not ruled out that it may be an individual. Although the burial site is unknown, rumors have been circulating among serial killer enthusiasts, forums, online since Sherman's execution. When questioned by the press about such online groups, the spokesperson added, these people who call themselves fans of killers are very foolish. If they were aware of the despicable details of such crimes as we in law enforcement are they would rethink their views about celebrating such heinous criminals. Police refused to confirm the name of the cemetery to the media in the aftermath of the news. And see, and that's why I think it's Monday. And then we just heard the tape with the psychiatrist saying that he became obsessed with his work mm -hmm. and they buried him at an undisclosed location. So who else would know other than somebody in law enforcement? Connie, oh, they had a dog. And there's something like that. I, I I looked at it already. Okay. Oh yeah, I think that was everything. The only thing I don't know now is the code for this door. Is it? It wasn't on the doll, right? Focus. <laughs> is this the O four five one? The same security. What the fuck would I know what that is? I no. We're supposed to find the code to the door. Yeah. It wasn't on Connie's bowl. No. Nope, there's nothing there. Let me go look again. And I think that just said Bethany on it. Was it in the other room? Behind I'm, room? I'm about to go look again, but I'm just going to retry my steps with everything in here. Because this one said, Mommy, stop crying. Yeah. Nope, no numbers on that. Your the, reflection. Man, <laughs> it's your reflection. <laughs> it wasn't on there. Or is it? Unless it's on the back of it. Oh, wait. right stick because you're going to scribble yep to find out 1999 i mean it couldn't be more obvious that this is like bullshit but So does killer don't talk? He's just completely silent. I guess Not so. even a grunt, like Arr, shut up, bitch. Alright, my character's life's probably gonna be in your hands. There's something on the mattress. I know. She's behind the mattress. I already know that. Or it's behind the mattress. The fuckery. Go ahead. Yeah, good try. That was a secret? I guess so. Why? How how is that a secret if it ends the Okay, I'm confused. 
And that one, he probably put one of her eyeballs in the one that my character popped, popped out. Oh, look, it's Charlie, risen from the dead. Oh, yeah. Phoenix, you rose from the ashes. I'm gonna ask you from now. You should walk out the door and get bapped right in the head. What? Or how many characters? Because how many characters? I guess I have more characters than you. No, you don't. We both have two. I had three. Okay. Okay. Just making sure. Because I have him and Homegirl, right? And then you Him have, and Jamie, yep. And you have Homeboy and And his, Kate. I have the couple. Okay. Cool beans. So actually, I just realized something. If the poll carried over, people won points because they bet on Shira to fumble a character first. I don't know if it carried over. I don't even think Tom's in the chat. Sure, go over to that and grab it before I go insane. And turn around. Yeah. Stand in front of it. Turn around. Look at it. Press square. Oh. Um, okay, try to push it through the hole. Okay, never mind. All right, there you go. It was just a little wonky. Yeah. But where am I supposed to push it to? Just let it go. Oh. I'm gonna crawl through the hole. That's your way out. So it's possible that we might still get to that premonition with Charlie and what's my face? Aaron? Aaron is dead. Oh yeah. I don't have the lighter. I can't see anything. <laughs> like, go nothing. go over there, right over here, over here. Yeah, there you go. Climb up on that. Oh my goodness! There we go. Not sure. You know you're not just gonna ignore that dude in the chair. Bro, I thought he was putting his dick on the conveyor belt. Oh <laughs> my god, bro. <laughs> I was like, That's what funny. is this? Bro. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Yo, that's wild though. That's a crazy image. projecting that's what the image looked like yeah that is actually uh, what it looked like let's learn biology always oh, <laughs>
the puzzle? Yeah. Wait, go back. Back out. Is there a way you're supposed to know the answer? I don't know. That's locked. Jog. Okay, I guess you just gotta push the button. I came out of here? Yeah, that's where you came from, yes. Okay. Or do I just push this button? First? I would go see what's up with him first. There has to be a way to know the answer. Like, I don't, I'm pretty sure you don't just guess a button. Like, well, they had us guess if we wanted to kill two people, so. Oh. Huh? I guess if you want to open the conveyor belt first, you can try that too. I think the conveyor belt, um, presses a story. Or maybe not. Yeah, don't jump on it. Oh no, I'm not. I'm not going to do that. Go back to the body. You just have to push one. But I need the key. What key? It says I have to lock and unlock the conveyor belt. Someone that cheated. Don't look at that. That was bullshit. Or maybe he has the key. Are you doing any mini mini mo? No. Just push one. I, it doesn't let me push it. Because you probably took too long. different audio cues that he has. No! Please! Just leave them alone! Oh, and then now it's time for the death. Please! Please! I'll do anything! That's it? Yeah. Yeah! That's it. He wanted them to leave his family alone. Um, I don't know. I don't think I should get on that. Well, climb up. Go back. Turn around. Because you also didn't climb up on the platform. It doesn't let me turn it off. Yeah, you can't. Go back to the platform over there. You didn't climb up on I that. I tried. Over here? Unless I was facing No, go over way. there. Go over there. Over here. Oh, this platform. Oh, cool. The lever's missing. So you have to find the lever and come back. Oh, all right. Just jump down. All right. Go about your business. What do you mean go about my business? Go about your business. There's nothing in here. <laughs> Shira, oh my god. What? Turn the camera around, look at the conveyor belt. I did, I saw the button. Do I, am I supposed to do it? Exit, there's nothing you could do. But there's no lever. I don't think I'm supposed to leave this room without the lever.
Mr. K told me to stop listening to you. <laughs> Alright, go back to the other room. Thank you for the whoa, thank you for the dono, Barry. Hope all is well. You playing that Resident Evil 4 remake? Of course. I think oh, that comes yeah, out in March. Jacket. Open the door. Oh, can I see if you can open the door from over here? No. No? But oh, there's a hole here. That's where you came in from. I know, but that's where the door leads to. I know, I was just hoping that it was like a shortcut. Nope, not. Oh, Jesus Christ. What? Sir, don't pretend like you don't get lost. Well, there's nothing else in here. Go read the thing again. It's just said don't get on it while it's running is literally what the thing says keep off R riding on the conveyor at any time can cause severe injuries entanglement hazard remember to switch off and lock out stay clear of the moving belt evacuate via the immediate emergency ladders okay so, so there's a ladder somewhere Yeah, I would have got you killed. I'm sorry. That's why I said, I, you, that's why you were saying the sign was BS. I'm like, no, it wasn't. I read it. It said, don't go on it. So where the hell is the emergency ladder? Okay. I don't know. Go up to that, right, that wood thing over there. That, nope. You sure this nigga don't got nothing to say? Go push another button. Because all of these things end up popping or blowing up or something. No. Is that one at the top of the button? Move all the way to the, move up. I'm trying. It's not. No? Only left and right? Yeah, only left and right. Okay. All right, just go back. I have no idea. I have no idea. Because you're going to go on that conveyor belt, and you're going to fall into a metal trap and die. Unless, I don't know if you can grab the lever from the other one. What other one? Go back. Go through the hole. Where was the other lever? The first one that you turned on when you when you woke up, when it was just complete and total darkness. I'll go to that door. Or not. This is the the flaming room. Go to your they go over there. I turn around. All the way around. Look, go straight in 40. Yeah. I don't think there's anything over here. I'm about to just go kill myself on the computer. No, 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 no. What? We had to turn on the power when we got out of there. It was dark. Where was that lever at? I don't remember. Go look at that door to your right. I think it was here. No, we didn't even come into this room. Oh, wow. It's going to send you into a trap. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Go back, go back, go back to the, the, try to position yourself so you can look. 
Alright. No, 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 no. I didn't tell you to look at it. Back out. Oh. Move the camera so you're looking at the floor. Stay right where you're at and then move the camera so that you're looking at the ground. Lift it just a little bit. Oh, yeah, you're gonna die. Don't do that. And this door is. Okay. So you said you don't remember where the lever. Am I supposed to do something with this this thing? No, you just have to move that out of your way. Are you sure? I'm positive. Can I climb up here with the thing? I don't know because there's stuff on top of it. Turn, turn around. Don't go back through the hole. Don't go back through the hole. We have to find. I, I want to see if we can find that lever? switch on the wall. Yeah. It's not in there. Oh, it went in there. But keep the camera up. Don't look at the floor. That's why we can't find it. Look look to your right. Look to your right. Okay. Turn around. Walk over to the left wall over here. Yeah, like walk over there. I can't. Can you go over there? No? No. The fuck? I can probably go here and then go around. All right, for two seconds, let me see. Um, nah, that's crazy. Did that shit disappear? I know in the chat they're probably like, oh my god, these niggas are so blind. I mean, it's clearly a puzzle. Oh, no, wait, no, it's there. there. Oh, shit. <laughs> the whole time. <laughs> oh, my God. We're looking for something that's already there. All right, sure, this is on you. I don't know. Is there anything I can put on it? Ready to hit a quick time event. Oh. Oh, oh shit. God. Ouch. Get up. No. No. I'm done. My guy.
literally done. I'm done. I'm done. Oh, wait. Please. I'm freaking done with these. No, he just wants to see you beg. He just likes to see you beg. Yeah! 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 I told you I'm gonna kill everybody in this game. I literally told you. I literally told y'all I don't wanna hear it. I literally told y'all I'm gonna kill every single person in this game. I promised you guys that I would. Shit! And why I get the extra hard effing people? I feel like I'm the only one actually actively trying to save these effing people. Oh, what the hell, bro? God. It's me. Get in here. Yeah. You can just... <sighs> Thank God. Well, you still got one left. We got three people left. What the hell is this? <laughs> somebody, somebody Pleased says. to see you too, up the phone Because I called it. Glad you're alive. <laughs> Thanks for the sub, Kai Bunga. Listen, I found out some new information. What? That guy on the ferry. That was not Dumet. That was Joseph Morello. He's a true crime writer. I found one of his books. How's he wrapped up in this? I don't know. Have you seen Mark? Not in person, but I spotted him on one of these monitors. Thank God. Thanks for the sub -art. I was worried sick about him. But I also saw Demet running around. Whoa! Hey, jump him! Run out the door. R run up on this fool, man! I hate the two of you. I hate these two characters so much. They could have snuck this man. Yeah, what is this? Umbrella Corporation? Jesus. What is all of this? He's got video feeds. Recording decks, a mixer big enough for countless mics. He's watching everything. It's more than that. He's got utilities running through here, hydraulics, electrics, everything. He can control the whole building from here. How far down does it go? This all connects. This is how he's getting around the house. This is too much. Charlie would say this guy is a fractured psych. That he's wearing a mask to put what he's doing on a different person. Take a look at this. What is that? The guy we saw murdered. It was a setup? There was no groundskeeper. We well, saw a guy in a yellow jacket with her stuff. I guess that was Mr. Demet. You haven't figured I it out yet? It's a mistake to say he's just crazy. He is in full control of what he's doing. He's just not wired like the rest of us. That's not crazy. Crazy implies out of control. Look at this place. Chicago police. Mr. Monday, this is Chicago police. Can you open the door, please? Oh, God, here we go. Mr. Monday, I'm Officer Stanley with Chicago Police Department. Can you hear me, sir? Agent Monday. Fuck. Fuck. Oh, uh, dispatch, this is Officer Stanley. I, I need assistance at 8 West 50th Street, requesting immediate backup. I'm in Agent Monday's apartment. There's, there's blood everywhere and, and a body. I need immediate support. I think... What's up? Yep, well, we just figured out who the killer is. I'm like 98% sure yeah, that it's, it's him. him. Wait, he's wearing the mask as part of the performance. At best, maybe he's insecure about something and it gives him confidence. Insecure? Like, low self-esteem? Is he uncomfortable at parties? Does, did his mommy not hug him enough? Yeah, is he uncomfortable at parties? Bad parenting can definitely be a factor, but... It could be a shitty dad just as much, or an uncle, any adult figure, really. Wow, look He's at been this chart. He's tracking us since we arrived. 
Mark was last seen in the basement. Mm. Don't you read any of our research? Mm. I just set up the lights. I'm sure he fits the profile. Bullied as a kid, unchecked anger. As an adult, he's either an extreme overachiever or a cipher. Nothing between. From Amber Harris to he Brandon Day. He likes being in Day. a position of power, especially over women. Okay, cool, but why? Thank Lots you, of people put up with that stuff and don't turn into killers. Aside from the unhealthy obsession with H.H. H. Holmes. H.H. H. Holmes? He's copying the M.O. <laughs> Clearly, he identifies with Holmes somehow. Thank you, Brandon. I have instructed our maker to proceed. We will keep you updated on progress. Can we use this gear to find a way out? Maybe we can open those shutters in the lobby. We will keep you updated on progress with photographs at each stage as promised. As discussed previously, we'll keep the production discreet. Thanks, Amber. Good morning, Amber. Thanks for your reply and putting my mind at rest. Yes, the cost is perfectly fine. Please go ahead. Reminder, this should remain confidential. Good morning, Brandon. I assure you that all of our custom masks, oh wow, are very robust. They are often used in long-running theater productions and filming intense action scenes. The material used for your mask is, plas is a plastic resin-coated wood, which provides toughened strength and is highly durable. Eighteen hundred dollars for that? That's ridiculous. All right. I guess it's a drop in the bucket compared to how much. Um they spent on this whole freaking project okay sweet so we can go down i can go up thanks for the sub ej jazz <clears throat> Bro, the drip. He got it drawn out. <laughs> he looks like the Monopoly man. <laughs> the fucked up Monopoly man. Uh, the game that makes you hate everyone. I remember watching Peaky Blinders. What is this? The fucking tape recorder. Hi, Mr. Monday. This is Lucinda Price from Twilight Prairie Herald. This progresses the story forward. All right, I'm gonna go downstairs, see what's down there, come back up, and then figure it out. My man is completely obsessed with H. H. Holmes. Michelle initially appeared excited, becoming increasingly agitated, rarely alone, more difficult to separate her. Wandered the hotel later last night. Is that an opportunity? Bathed away from family room, noticeably tired towards the end of the day. Drink socially, use this. Heavily, heavy sleeping pills, target her at the end of the day. Give wine and sleeping pills when bathing. Separate her! Body out of a pool. 
Cecile Hall, death from blood loss after impalement on a sundial body disposed of. Kurt Hall, multiple gunshot wounds. Thomas Hall, single gunshot wound, execution. Oh, and here we are. He's profiling us. This is crazy. Thir Kate Wilder, 30 years old, PTSD. What? Para what does it say? Parox paroxetine anxiety? Yeah, I don't know what that word is. Charlie, 49 year old, smoker underscore borderline narcissist. Identify weaknesses. Let's see. Aaron, 24, asthma. Self confidence issues. Damn. Oh, look, Mark. Uh, something phobia. Aerophobia. Yeah, so he knows he has a fear of heights. He's going to use that. Did that say ass taxi? A what? <laughs> In the right hand corner on the. On the on the dry erase board. This, this is everything about me. And Jamie Jesus. Tiergen, 26. Let's see. You got her insurance number, everything. Self-destructive tendencies and she's impulsive. Kate is 30. Oh yeah, paroxetine. That's her medicine. Initial dose, 20 milligrams orally once a day. Maintenance dose, 20 to 50 milligrams orally once a day. Maximum dose, 50 yeah, milligrams Yeah, they're a supposed day. to double team him, a 128-pound chick and a 119-pound chick. Patient <laughs> sees medication. <laughs> for natural remedies. Anxiety, she's allergic to penicillin. Recurrent PTSD with a question mark. Aaron. Corticosteroid inhaler, a butyrol inhaler, asthma. Her allergies are house dust mite, pollen, house. Which he pit. kept surrounding her with. Yeah. Why does it say ferryman? Where? Right there. Oh, he, I guess he's gonna be the next ferryman. Oh, what? That he's that? sending over, like um, the how the prior guy, the bald guy. Oh. He's gonna send. He's gonna give him a chance to either die or bring him back five more people. And he's traded for acrophobia. Interesting. This borderline narcissist here. Who's already dead anyway? That was a good catch. That that's what that meant. The ferryman. So he was planning on keeping him alive. Why is the black person always the ferryman? Because this is clearly racially motivated. <laughs> well, glad I came down here. Saw some interesting stuff. Where's he getting the money for all of this? Like. How are you funding this operation, my guy? Over here. Look at this. It's all his little tricks and moving walls and crap. Nothing in this shit box is real. Shit he box? controls everything from here. It's a murder factory. You're right. We should use this against him. I want to find Mark, not play Demet's game. If we trap him, we can look for Mark without looking over our shoulders the whole time. Okay, look. He's in here, right? So we get him to go down this hall, and we trap him between these two moving walls. There's no other way out of there. He'd be stuck. Okay, but how do you make sure he goes down that hall to begin with? Funnel of but he has remotes. One of us is going to have to be bait. 
No, no way. It's too risky, Jamie. So is letting him run free. I'd say that's more dangerous. Come on. There's no second chances here. It's my plan. I'll be the bait. Yeah, of course if you're you sure. Are. Just. Oh, because that's you. If it looks yeah. like it's going south, get the hell out of there. Of course, no you'll be the here. effing bait, ma'am. Yeah, just have me do more work. Um. You know what? You could use that as a weapon if need be. I'm gonna hang on to it. I'm more likely to need it. Yep, give her a hug. That's the last time you're ever gonna okay. see her again. <laughs> That's enough of a moment. Listen. Let's do this. Stick to the plan. <laughs> Obviously. So how do we get out? Third floor must be a work in progress. Okay, be ready. You're gonna have to time it right to trap him and not me. Wait, am I gonna have to do this? All right. No. Here goes nothing. Cause they hate me. So they're gonna make me do it. Yep. Of course. Of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Freaking course. <laughs> Thanks for the Don Leo. Sure, I'll press the button at the right time. Listen, head down the hall. Give me Get a game. Right. Wait, 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 wait. Go back. What was that? What? Are those numbers on the walls? Give me a game that's not anxiety-inducing. Six. six. Is that is that another six? Go turn around. Turn around. And then maybe I can hit them one time. Like slow. Turn. What are you talking about? On the wall. Yeah, it's a six. Okay. I thought I was losing my mind. Are you sure? Yes, that is a six. And then there's another six that you just passed. Okay, five. Five. Okay, I don't know what this is about. It's probably just construction shit. Was this on the map? Oh my god. Plan well, the plan failing. already clapped, bro. Well, on the bright side, if she dies, then I'm done. It's finished. Hey, listen, you better save this girl. I'm going to try. Turn around. No guarantees. That's hilarious, bruh. More rooms being built. Huh. Oh. What? So who was closing the door? That was a good one. That was a good one. They threw you off with that one. saw him go in not that way not that way not this way the closed door that you're avoiding back that way 
Ma'am? This one? Yes. No, the one behind you. Oh, this is where we went and hid. In that closet. Yeah, we did. We looked at all of that stuff. I didn't know if maybe they replaced it with anything new. What is this, bro? Jamie, fucking run! Oh, so I guess that was supposed to happen. Oh, God. What a flop of a plan. He said control all the leave. Fuck. He said run. You don't think he would have fail safe to his own fucking house? Oh Bro. my gosh. They better not let you be able to get my character killed. Bros, that's trash. Well then help me make the decision if there's a decision. We saw her get crushed by the wall. Shit. Yes, we did. Who, Jamie, right? Yes. Or was it Kate? No, my person gets crushed by the wall. What is it? A button. There's a reverse symbol on it. What, what, what does it? Shit. No! Isn't there? 
That's so trash. Why all of these decisions on me? That's so annoying. This is so annoying. I'm what so an excruciating way to go. Jamie pressed the button to kill Kate. I know they didn't always see eye to eye, but I didn't think she'd be that cold-blooded. Jamie chose not to save Erin when she could, leaving her to die, deprived of oxygen, suffocating to death. Charlie, he managed to escape the furnace, only to fall straight into Jumet's grasp. I don't, I don't understand. Hint I gave you earlier. Help. But see, that's so misleading. Perhaps you'd like another. I'll, I'll tell you in a second. Let's see if Sir Arthur can help us. This is from the man with the twisted lip. Have you read it? You should. A trusty comrade is always of use. And a chronicler, still more so. I think that last bit might refer to me. You should get back. I hope these chats are helpful. I certainly no! wouldn't want them to be intimidating. I'll be watching your progress. As always, watching very closely. What, what was it? The screwdriver? Yes, but she was banging on it with that first. Like, that's so misleading. That's almost like they give you the... the. Because if she had have not taken it out and done that, I would have been like, oh, she'll be fine. She has the screwdriver. But because she already took it out and was banging on the thing with it, I'm like, okay. So what was so going to happen? the screwdriver doesn't work. It would have worked? I guess so. But I feel like that's misleading. Just like the first trap where he's like, the windows are bolted shut. There's no way to, like, get them out. And then you're like, oh, well, there was a crack in one of the windows. Okay, but Mark literally said the windows were bolted shut. Like, the, if that's gonna be the case, they have to do better with like, like the direction. Because I'm very analytical, and if you're, if I see her banging on the thing with a screwdriver, I'm gonna think it doesn't work. Unless she like wedged it in between the wall and the glass, and it somehow stopped. Listen, it. I saw her die in the premonition, so I'm like, okay, well, if I don't do anything, she's gonna die. Fuck. Wait, is it my go? Did it say it was my turn? I, oh, I, I I don't know. I don't know. It was yes, it did. It did. Oh. A major issue that I'm having right now is that there's too many uh, too many of the decisions fall on you to get my characters killed, and I don't get a chance to do anything. Like, I'm trying to do this legit, like how the movie night's supposed to go. She makes the decisions. So it's like, like my, my characters are falling in Shira's hands. What's the point of me playing? Wait, it went back to Jamie. But I thought it, it switched to you after the puzzle. to his face.
Weave. What the hell was that? I, I don't know. There was nothing there. Oh, good job. Oh, oh, bro. Bro, the not the family guy, bro. Oh, sure, you got to fix his body. Listen, I would take the pipe and I would repeatedly beat his head. Rest repeatedly. Repeatedly, just to make sure. Repeatedly take the pipe and beat this man's head. Nah, ain't no way this ain't no way he's dead. He's not. Okay. Are you fucking kidding me? You're just good? It's only her and Mark left. Mark probably don't got nothing. Uh, he doesn't have a lot to do. That's why he keeps giving you the control. Everybody else is gone. Well, then let Mark do something. Mark ain't did nothing on game. This your play too. This way. Seriously, this is not where I want to be. That's where you came from. That's where you came from. Turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around. What is the dead end? Left, right. 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 It's okay, now end. right. Turn around. That way. Well, you're not technically going back in. You're just trying to find a way out. That was just the middle of it. But I mean, this is not there going go. the way I came, right? Oh, you got to find the switch. Oh, now the switch is missing. 
Oh, what about that piece of paper on the ground? To your right. I saw something else glimmer there. Uh, I didn't. Now you saw what? A piece of paper to your right. Turn around. To your right. Look down on the ground. Back up a little bit. Right there. Oh. your son but I married you for you and not your son besides it's your ex-wife's responsibility to stop him from doing stupid things not mine well, I don't know I think I may be just depressed already because of this trip it's not what I had in mind when you said you were taking me away to a secret island I don't care if he is Harrison Lee the famous horror fiction writer you only work for him you don't have to go on vacation with him too can we spend some time just the two of us this year you hurt. I thought it would be easier to write this down because I get upset when I try to talk to you about it. I'm in distress. You know I don't get along with Thomas. I just don't get why we have to take him everywhere with us. By your own admission, he is a effing nightmare and it's getting me down having him around all the time. Is that, is that all blocked off? Or yeah, you just have to head back there. Okay. That's not where you came from. Okay. Oh, did you run past those dolls on the way here? No. No, I didn't. I don't think so. I, ran I think past it is, horse. yeah. Then I'll go back to where I was just now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go back and then go across to the other side, left, and then go across to the other side of the maze. I did go across to the other side of the maze. Where are you going? Trying to get out. Okay. Yeah, this is the way I gotta know how to get out. Um, this is the bar. This is a dead end. I'm oh, just saying to go back out over way. here. Okay. Yeah, no, what the hell? That's weird. Okay. Oh, no, no, don't go back over there. I'm not. I'm just running around to see uh, if I missed anything. Right there. Right there. Up. Oh. Crouch down and go under there. Oh, okay. I look down on the floor. Look down on the floor? Yeah, we saw something glimmer up here, no? I don't okay, I guess it was just telling you that it's a. S oh, there we go, there, there goes the switch. Pretty sure this is planned because he knows. Doesn't he know she's like a lighting technician? Maybe we can get this thing working. Okay, you can't use it yet. It's not on. The red, the light's off. Oh. You gotta put this. You have to use the switch. This okay. circle. And that you could jump down from here. So now we have to go to the um. Go back to the power box. So it was over that way.
Right there. Yep. Right back where you are. So go back underneath that place. And then go back up the steps and then now you can press the buttons. Turn around. Turn around, you're going the wrong way. Turn right over there. There. Now I don't know. I guess you just push the buttons because it hasn't seemed to matter yet. Yeah, I guess you just hit all three of them. Yes, you're going the right way. Crouch. <laughs> Yo, this girl has had more screen time than anybody else in the entire game. Uh, Jordan Patterson, I agree. In terms of Char Charlie and Aaron. It's a Charlie and Aaron with only two like real personalities in the game. Everybody else is just bland. Sit there and try to close it, stupid. Back the fuck away from me. I'm warning you. Cool. I can't wait to not do anything and then have them give the controller back to Jamie.
can't see nothing in here. Oh, nice. I can't jump down there. There we go. Jesus. That is a black hand. I looked in there already. Yeah, that was the same place. Yo, it is dark as hell, bro. I don't know if these photos are gonna amount to anything once this game is over, but I guess we're gonna find out. Oh God, what happened here? Somebody got their shit pushed back. Two people I said would die first are the last two people alive. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. That's actually true. Isn't that something? It is something. And the game told me. <laughs> Harrison and Lewis Lee. playing with the softest character in the whole game. <laughs> this nigga Mark is so soft. <laughs> Do I even need the CDs anymore? Ooh. Oh! Yes, yes, you do need to see those. All right, stay away from windows, bruh.
that the lighthouse up there? It's so crazy because like to me this one started out bad it got good and then it just fell apart after the middle portion they said something similar happened in jazzy and dwayne's playthrough so jazzy had to start playing some of dwayne's characters <laughs> listen I, yo i'll say this this ended up being the worst one and they gassed it up like it was the best one but decision wise like character wise like i don't know if i'd say it was the worst which one can you say was worse than this where shit didn't make no sense when you made decisions the and there was the a plot hole. was kind of weird man of medan i didn't think it was weird i just thought it was predictable like mm. like the choices and stuff made sense but the story was just very easily predictable like we knew they yeah. were hallucinating but like yeah that's true this one it's like Bro, what you gonna let in a move in a movie night mode? Like, you have movie night mode, but then you give control of the death of everybody's characters to everybody else. It doesn't make any sense. Yeah, that's true. Did you see it with the post? There was a glimmer on it. Yeah, I saw. I oh, seen it. Okay. I was just seeing what this was. This was just a shortcut. Shoot. And like you said, the whole screwdriver situation. The whole crack in the window shit, which you I don't see. I just think see. it's very misleading, like it's too misleading to the point where like it doesn't give you enough to make like like to sway your decision. It does too much to sway your decision. Said, somebody else said exactly when I played this with my friend all my characters got clapped by him yes. and I think that's not fair that's dumb bro jump okay <laughs> I watched Dwayne and Jazz they had some bones to pick too <laughs> Bro, what? I do think the saw puzzles were very creative. I just think the the execution of like the decisions yeah, so was just slightly very better. poor. My nigga. Did I walk over here for no reason? I can't jump across that? What is happening? Am I bugged out? Okay, Until Dawn and the Quarry don't count. Until Dawn and the Quarry, like I said, those are games made by the A-Team. And then the Man of Medan games are made by, you can tell, a totally different team of people. I was saying this was the worst one out of the Man of Medan bunch. Um, I just want to make sure I'm not tripping. Can I not make it over there? What do you mean jump like Kratos? You're able to jump the entire game. The whole game you're able to jump le to jump ledges. All right, that is wasting my motherfucking time. Oh, they, somebody said the only reason why they found out about the leak in the window was because Jassy had your same logic about the inhaler. So they, she chose to kill Kate and then just magically saved the other one because there was a leak in the window. So it just she just got lucky with that particular option. Mm. But it's very, they said it's very easy to kill Eren. Like they made it, like it's hard to save Eren. Why, why, why make me inspect that?
Okay. They All said, right. They said he's not bugs. He's not Kratos. <laughs> They're saying he's not Kratos. Like that's a long jump. That's not a long jump. That's the same distance as all the other jumps you've made in the game. Or is it this I'm supposed to do? There's nothing in here. Said Dwayne got lucky with a screwdriver. He thought he was keeping it, but gave it to Kate. Wait, so Kate was supposed to have a screwdriver? I'm confused. Off of that comment, actually. I don't know. Oh, so no, I did make the right decision, but Kate didn't have the screwdriver to save herself. Oh, so we were so okay. So we were fucked from the moment they said you, you chose to give the screwdriver. So from that point. She was already effed, probably. Yeah, they said whoever has the screwdriver survives getting crushed. So yeah, you were screwed from that, from that moment. I mean, on that note, they did say like even the smallest decisions can get you killed. They said yeah, that's why Roshi set up shirts to get his own character killed. So they're saying I technically didn't kill her. You killed her because you made the decision for her not to take the screwdriver with her. <laughs> so. But wait, but no, I just realized. So based on what they're saying, they said it could work either way. It can work either way. Yeah. If you're me, you have to choose to kill yourself. If she has a screwdriver, you choose to kill her. So it could work yes. either way. Okay. Cause I was like, mm. but I still think Nigga, that, that it was misleading. Like I said, cause she pulled out her screwdriver. She was hitting it against the glass and it didn't work. So that's why I was like, okay, like, Clearly, don't choose me because this screwdriver thing doesn't work. Yes, that was the problem. Somebody said, but I've heard of situations where some people have the screwdriver and die anyways, but that might be a glitch. <laughs> oh, wow. That's awesome. What are you oh, doing, my nigga? Trying to get out. Jeez, why did I look down? Oh, 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 hey, where the hey, fuck did that boy. come from? Okay, easy does it. Check the dog. Now is not the time for you to be afraid of a dog. 
They're not gonna give me the option to kick a dog. Uh, sir? So you're gonna fall off the cliff? Bro, what kind of trash aim? I literally aim to throw the rock at the dog and then he just misses. Somebody had a good point in just saying basically like the developers assume you want to try again to see how different decisions will lead to saving other characters. Mm -hmm. But if they don't enjoy the game, then people aren't going to try again and aren't going to care to yes. see how they can save characters. I would. I'm, I think that they shouldn't make that assumption like, oh, well, if they F it up this time, they can try again next time. It's like, no, just yeah, like, make it clear Just like enough. how in all of them, they make decisions where it's like, um, or it's like, oh, be nice or be an asshole. And you choose be nice and then they're an asshole but in a nice way and you're like that's not what i said to say the only game i think where that was you know valid was the one game where there was like a whole bunch of different outcomes like based on things that you chose um that one game you played i don't remember what it was called like to break in and steal your luggage or to leave that was the luggage. quarry oh yeah the quarry okay so that's the only one i say is valid to like be able to like assume someone wants to replay that again but <laughs> this like i don't know if i would be like i don't know if i would care enough to i'm not to playing see. this shit like i would again. i wouldn't care enough what of our the decisions characters are not that interesting to me <laughs> our dishes our decisions are law in this game so whatever it is that's it like, i feel like you don't really get to world. know them like how you get to know the other characters in the other games i feel like these characters don't maybe i know a handful of them but then the others died early. Did he just pass out? Oh. I thought he fell, like trying to. He did fall, but. God damn it. That was odd. All right, hole in the fence. I can go there, but let me just see. Yeah, I, I just, okay. They said go back, there was a prompt. Are you still looking at YouTube? No, Twitch. Oh, yeah, the fence. I didn't get a prompt though. Oh. That's why I ran past it. Oh, okay. But instead of opening that, I can climb this ladder. And then there's a window. What is this for? Okay. Gotta keep going up, I guess.
only death I hold myself responsible for is trying to <laughs> Yeah? <laughs> that one was wholeheartedly my fault. But the other two, I don't know. I think. And there's some gray area there. What is that smell? Oh, I'm stuck. Ugh. Whatever was upstairs is gone now. How's your head? Two victims discovered with heads switched. What the hell? a very insensitive newspaper headline. But everything is on right now. Unless he turned everything off. Hmm. Didn't I just fall and it switched to you? What the hell just happened? Oh, it's full time. <laughs> this guy is everywhere at once. Worst surveillance camera checker ever. He checks the surveillance camera and it will be in the exact room with us and never looks thoroughly. Oh, you're about to get the heartbeat. You know what I also think was helpful in the quarry? She actually gave us good hints to where we knew what decisions oh, to make. Oh yeah, to save the cards. Oh yes. This one, it was like, eh, you just better figure it out because <laughs> I gave you a riddle. <laughs> hey, you want me to give you a hint and then make shit even more confusing? All the colors in the rainbow, twist the sky <laughs> across a long night day. <laughs> I'm like, what? What? <laughs> It, it makes it even harder to survive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll give you a hint. Yeah, I'll give you a hint. What is water but not wet? <laughs> like, what? Oh, cool. I was expecting a jump scare. Oh. All right, I don't know why it was green, but whatever. Jesus. Harrison Lee. What the hell? What do you mean, what the hell? That's a body, sir. All right. Yeah. 
Subject dead by asphyxiation. Subject washed, freezing. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> you pulled at me. I did. <laughs> you didn't You let go of the button. I did. Because I don't feel like you should have to hold the button. <laughs> <laughs> the subject washed. Freezing that required is formaldehyde solution has been prepared. Move to curing house to commence preservation. LED decomposition is not yet shown obvious deterioration. Viable specimen for animatronic integration. Formaldehyde fixation solution introduced to subject's cardiovascular system. Fixation solution process complete. Subject added to the acetone bath. Re-examination in 24 hours. No issues found with subject in acetone. No signs of rigidity as of yet. Re-examined in 48 hours. Good progress, signs of rigidity and extremities. Previous subject, Mr. Lewis Harrison, required disposal in acid bath, rigor mortis, reached skin, causing severe blistering, resulting in unviable specimen. Possibly due to subject's smaller stature, expediting decomposition, 185 pounds versus 142 pounds. Delayed fixation commencement or formaldehyde level estimate too low. Continued positive progress. Extremities fully hardened. Oh, extending into stiffness of limbs. Re-examining in one week. Limbs 50% hardened. Oh yeah. Acetone drained and replaced. Re-examined in 24 hours. You're ridiculous. Fucking Bill Nye the science guy, bro. Yeah, the quarry cast versus the devil and me cast. Stop. <laughs> Stop. Ice JJ Fish trumps this whole cast a little. <laughs> <laughs> and that's not saying much. The peanut butter butter pops scene is better than the whole game. Impregnation curing. Hey, bro, you want to kill me and then eat my meat? Whoa, bro, what you got going on in here, dog? Man, trying to, you're trying to kill me and get my meat stiff, bro. This is this is a wild killer right here. Somebody said, "Think y'all should kill your characters and call it a day." <laughs> <laughs> can I, can I actually go through the, the front door? You didn't pay your taxes, Mr. Way Shelby. Out. I have come to collect. Yeah. Right here? No, no, right here. Oh, that was the newspaper. I looked at that. That was the box. Eee, huh? No. What the fuck is this? It's Nigga, is that a body? Is that is that Charlie's body? Yeah, I think so. Well, no, he wasn't wearing that. It's mangled. Ah, here we go. Don't worry, Rogue, you'll have it at least once each month. What? She said she needs some sauce in her box. I said, don't worry, you'll have it at least once each month. Some sauce in her box. Heavy flu. <laughs> Even though I know that's not the sauce she was talking about. <laughs> I'm, I'm just going to act like I didn't get involved with y'all conversation. <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck, bro? My man. My man, open the door. Uh. Uh, let's make all kinds of noise.
like me turning on the, the music in the courtyard. Yeah, let me just let the killer know exactly where I am. So this, this inefficient killer with no gun. Cause I would have came in there and started blasting, bro. He <laughs> said, bro, just alerted the whole island. <laughs> <laughs> This holds. Thanks for joining, Angel. Missing my man's Dylon. Yeah, Dylon was dope. Yeah. And you crippled him. <laughs> the second playthrough. See, that game was worthy of a second playthrough. Maybe it even was. a third playthrough. You didn't get your neck slammed on the the glass. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah of, course. of course, immediately. Thank you for the Donald Monkey mm, said disarray. Every other game <clears throat> survived this game. <laughs> so you want to die an hour <sighs> later? Wow, that's what it feels like. Just, the hoeing. I just start in. I just start in immediate disarray. Like just immediate. Yeah, because you fell. I know. I saw, oh, there it is. See, I wouldn't even be picking up coins at a time like this. But she has to give them to the narrator because he has hints or whatever the fuck we're supposed to be using these coins on that I, I don't, I have not seen yet. We're supposed to be giving them to the narrator. Yeah, but he hasn't really. Yeah, he, he gave us riddles. <laughs> I'd climb up. Really? I don't think you can. Go to it. What do you mean you don't think you can? Yeah, you can't. See? You can't. It's another one of your third toilet schemes. No, I guess go to the right and crawl under that other tree oh, I branch. I guess I gotta get to that bridge. Yeah, so drop down. I'm gonna go to your left, immediately <laughs> left. Okay, I go under it, not above it. There's a lot of shuffling and shit going on with these, these trees. <laughs> I'm gonna need them to calm down. The trees are rocking the boat. I thought getting outside would make things better. If y'all remember how the F y'all got up here. Oh, wow, cool. We're right back where we started. Oh, it, investigate the farmhouse. Okay, so I am supposed to be over here. So I'm not back where I started. Oh, yeah, this is clearly a different house. I'm just saying it's perfect because this is a whole ass another house. Why are we going in houses? Why are we not leaving? Leave how? I don't know, but I wouldn't be going back in the houses. Oh, the effing dog is in here. After I just hit it with a rock? Battle damaged. About to get mauled. Oh, is that an animatronic dog? Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, what? How are you everywhere, bro? Thank you for joining. Time for some more clappage facts. Drops axe. Oh. It's okay, boy. I won't hurt you. If you don't shut up. 
Is she about to kill the dog if it starts? I don't know, but they're gonna make me make an L decision. Don't do it. Then it's a game. They're not gonna let you kill a dog. I should have did it. I thought they would not make you I kill a dog, bro. I should have effing did it. I should have did it. No! I should have did it. I should have killed the dog. Oh. Tomato oh. sauce! Okay. They're like, I stupid. Did it. I should have did it. I should have killed this stupid epic dog. <laughs> Listen, the game is. They if that would have clapped me, I would have got so mad. They don't want that smoke. You know how much flack they would get if they made you kill a dog Listen. in a game? Um, like, if they forced you to do it to survive? You gotta... You gotta think, man. They said now nah, all of a sudden he can't aim. Yeah, you got James Bond equipment. Trackers. So what did I see? A cabin? No, you're going to the same place where I'm at, I believe. <laughs> it says the man who wanted the option to kick said dog. Is everybody still alive for y'all? <laughs> ah, funny question, Queen Ari. <laughs> funny question. <laughs> you know what, guys? Maybe we planned this. Maybe sure. Maybe me and sure planned to only keep the black people why alive. Why didn't we sta stab him in the back with the bottle? Let's get the light off. Because she's stupid. Why did he miss? They said Jamie dies if the dog lives in some choices. I wonder what saved y'all. <laughs> so that actually can kill you to keep the dog alive. That's wild. Okay, you know what? The coins unlock dioramas and they don't affect gameplay experience to access it. You gotta go to the main menu, scroll to dioramas. Okay. Wow, I maxed out the brightness and I still cannot see. That shows you how dark they made this room. Yeah, we only got two people left, Queen Ari. to save both Jamie and the dog Kate need to hide so she can surprise attack behind but we don't have Kate so I don't know how that works out oh all of these business cards say something different oh they said if Kate is alive you die oh wow Wow, so they really force you to shank a pup? That's crazy. Evidence. Is that Jamie? Oh, yeah. 600 hours, I, Officer Frank Hooper, discovered that one or multiple individuals had gained unauthorized access to the evidence mm -hmm. room at 1612 West State Street. Among the missing items were assets recovered from the apartment of former FBI agent Hector Monday 
including books, clothes, notes, surgical tools, and dental equipment. We are currently running with the theory that this was the direct result of souvenir hunters looking for a piece of memorabilia from the case. End of report. Yeah, I'm sure. But yeah, they said Kate basically, you have, you have to hide Kate in order to survive with Jamie the dog. If you don't, then they get clubbed. So we probably would have got clapped if we killed the dog. Yeah. Hector Waylaw in London. <laughs> Bachelor of Science in Psychology. Hmm. May 22nd of 88. I mean, they didn't give you uh, three million hints to let you know that this is Hector Monday. Mr. Kumar, I want my team dead. What? I'll get them to you this weekend. Just do it. Was that Charlie? I can't believe it. Yeah, he doctored it. This is a clever edit. Yeah. That's not how Charlie speaks. Okay. I was gonna say, uh oh no, never, never mind. Let me not spoil the movie. The movie just came out. What? The menu. Oh. Yeah. I almost dropped a nasty spoiler. By the way, check that movie out if you haven't seen it. The menu. If you're into like Cabin in the Woods type like movies, satiri like satirical films or social commentaries, I'd go check it out. It was a great movie. Looks like there may be another boat on the island. Yeah, the boat that gets crashed. Letter from 1965, bruh. Clarence, I thought I should write you with the news as you haven't been able to see me in six months. You have a son. I gave birth a few weeks ago. I need you back here. I can't do this alone. My parents are helping out, but they're both very old now. Come home, Clarence, please. L Monday. This guy's a gangster. His real name's Clarence. Son of a bitch! Give me a dog any day. Yeah, I'd give you a dog any day so you could throw rocks at it. <laughs> we already see what you do with dogs, sir. That's it. I don't get to fully look in there. My dude. Oh, there's a picture. I, I looked at it already.
sneak in our picture. They're they're all just blurry, like just blurry shots. All right. Looks like when my three year old takes pictures in her her, her iPad. It just There's a bunch of fucking. You see selfies. a corner of the ceiling, <laughs> corner of a hand. Nah, bro. There has to be something I did not see up here. Oh, okay. There's a whole nother walkway. Oh, I can't wait for him to be on the roof. No way. Oh my goodness, he would be on a tower. But this is where he dies. Mm. In the premonition, right here. Yep. He gets his head smashed on this glass right here. Yep. Or his throat. No, no, yeah, that's what I have to do, for sure. Uh, I know a lot of people have been asking for us to play as Dusk Falls. So that's on the radar, too. Said it's fire. They said as dust falls isn't even a game, it's an interactive film. <laughs> From what I've seen, yeah. Was it quick times? No, it's like this it's decision based game. But I think like you can have a controller in your hand. And like, I think we both get to make decisions and then like, let's say there's two options mm -hmm. and I pick one and you pick another, the game picks oh, yeah. automatically. So, it's so we can either, joint decision. we can either agree or we can disagree if we really don't like agree. That's what I think. Bro. The fucking power is right here. They said you can also overreal, overrule choices. It's just choices. Hmm, sounds a little bit more up my alley. <laughs> no good times. And they said yes, if you're split, the game can randomize it. Based games I've played since Detroit. You can also have Switch chat, even participate within the decision making, and that's super fun. That sounds cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, do a chat voting for all the choices. <laughs> so, yeah, I can clap everyone. <laughs> bro, where do we turn on the power, bro? Come on. I think he has the most annoying um, light out of all. All the people. Yes, everybody has a fucking flashlight. Here goes this nigga here with his camera. Charlie flash. had a lighter. Um Jamie had a flashlight. 
bro. Back inside we go. They said what y'all looking for is up top. I ain't trying to back to you, but just save y'all some time. Thank you. This is a big house. Mad floors. That Mark has the most boring sections. Bruh. Yes. <laughs> this nigga don't see no action, bro. Oh, there we go. Don't look down. Don't look down. Don't look down. Oh, mama. <laughs> Tampering with this seal is a federal offense. If he would have died, I just would have accepted it. If he would have died, I would have turned off your console. <laughs> I would have turned your console off. If he went out like that. All right, so we have the premonition of me getting my neck slit on the glass, but now comes the fun part in trying to prevent that from happening. Ow! Are you fucking? Oh. Have all the fun. Have all the stress, you mean? <laughs> it said my turn, but it's still you. Like when it did that the other it? time, it said it was your turn. It said it was your turn, but it was still me running. Oh, there I am. Hey, hey, up here, Jamie. What? Hey. Gosh, I'm so annoyed. I am so annoyed because I know that effing decision is gonna be my decision. <laughs> we'll see. I'm annoyed. We'll see. What the hell is that smell? Jesus. Yeah, wow. exactly. That's exactly what that smell is. I wasn't expecting. What? Are you early for a change? The fuck is that? Ew. Happy Thanksgiving. I think those are the recordings from his mom they were talking about in the thing. Recovered. St. Paul's Cemetery. 
Dear Mr. Monday, I'm writing to inform you of an issue with plot R357P12-4 as the right of internment is in your name. It is my duty to inform you of a recent incident at burial plot R357P12-4. A patch of soil has been disturbed and the headstone was moved from its base. I understand that this is the grave of your late mother, Lucinda Monday. Therefore, I appreciate that this news may be distressing. Unfortunately, on rare occasions, local wildlife can cause such disturbances, and we suspect that this is the case in this instance. As a matter of public safety, it is our duty to ensure maintenance of our plots is of a very high standard, and we have swiftly corrected the disturbance. There has been no permanent damage. Sincerely, Jeffrey Gray. Oh, I saw that already. So, when we saw him next to that old lady, was he playing recordings of her voice? And she was I think dead so, in the yes. chair? Mm -hmm. What the fuck is this? Oh, yeah. Oh, yep. Speak of the devil. We gotta grab the key from her. She has a key on yeah, her. Yeah, I'm gonna go over it by her. Oh, that's not a key. Wow. That's disgusting. How dare he do that to his mother's body? Yeah, you puppeteering your mom, son? Freaking um, dead silence. Mark, can you hear me? Where the hell is he? Bitch, on the other side of the door. What the hell? Mark, where is he? I hear him on the other side of the door, but does that Mark. mean that's where? He... <laughs> what happened to you? Keep moving. Where is she? Mark, I'm sorry. Sir, now is not the time. to flag the police. He's in cahoots with the popo. -po. Nah, he's just gonna die too. Are we gonna steal his boat? No, we found keys to a different boat. Mm. Oh. oh, that was the guy. Hands where I can the see them, girl. all of you. Mm -hmm. Yep, he killed them. No talking. I said hands where I can see them. Thank God you're here. You have to help us. Until I know what's happening here, no one moves. Yeah, they said, and our characters are black. <laughs> We didn't do a thing, you gotta believe us. You'll have a chance to tell your story. 
They say yam yeah, guy, we got to play no more. <laughs> this should work. Oh, it's dead. This better work. Oh, come on. Come on. <sighs> Mark, pull it, bro. You're a big dude. Pull it. Hell. What an L character, bro. <sighs> If he's holding on to the back of the boat, I am done. I am done. So what the hell do we call a cop over there for? Just to get clapped for no reason? This is about to be the most incredible. He's on the ever. boat because you have the maze. <laughs> Did it. We're gonna make it. Not all of us made it. I'm so mad. I'm ready for the hand. Yep. Come on. Come on. There we go. <laughs> you have got to be kidding. The mace. You have the mace. That's not mace. What is it then? I don't know, but it damn sure was the mace. was mace. Whatever. Of course it was mace. Oh! Oh! So it did still happen. So the 
<laughs> you would have missed me all the time. <laughs> yeah, we could have. We could have. We could have died on the boat. We could have died at the very yeah, last Yeah, we could have blew up. Whoa, we could have blew up. That's crazy. Shira. If that song doesn't put a smile on your face, I don't know what will. We have a nonstop block of your favorite classic rock after this break. No damn commercials. You about to see two niggas run out in the road? Oh, oh help! They did everything! Lock oh, wait, up. what are you doing? Look at the road, Shit. bro. Show market and never yeah, this is a and I up, and there they were just in the middle of the flipping road, waving their hands and arms like a bunch of crazies. And where are you coming in from? Uh, Fort Wayne. Been driving since 3 a.m. Early start. Well, I was trying to get into the port by 8. Probably not going to make that now, am I? I'd say likely not. Oh, 5.30. Yeah. Two characters, sure as said, <laughs> would die first, be dead first. Are the only two that survived. <laughs> Yo. Black Panther secret ending. Stop. <laughs> we got February early. <laughs> He's writing his dice like, this is your worst performance yet. He's like, the niggas. <laughs> oh. Hector Monday. Killer was Hector Monday. Was that his son? Ah. Oh, what is going on? Oh, yeah, because it's the end of season one. Oh wow, it opened up a deeper a deeper part of the library. It opened a portal to Wakanda. <laughs> Wakanda Wait, what is, hang on. Oh, you're here. All good things must come to an end, but how good was the end for our crew? Unfortunately, you lost a few of them. So, rest in peace. Kate, it's a final close-up and cut. It's a wrap. Charlie, I'm afraid it looks like series two isn't going to be commissioned after all. Yeah? And Erin. The new girl surprised everyone with her courage, but now she's gone to the great audio suite in the sky. What about those who survived? Has the experience changed them? Jamie learned that she had to trust other people and work with them. And Mark had to stop waiting for people to tell him what to do. He had to make his own way in the world. I'll tackle the paperwork in the morning. Can you find your own way out? It was, as always, enlightening. I have no doubt we'll meet again in the future. Farewell. They said to, there's stuff to see 
get to the credits roll. Okay. Oh my gosh, this man better better not. He's still alive? Are you kidding me? What do you got? I'm so annoyed. How? How is he still alive? The chain of events are still unclear at this point in time. What we can confirm is that a little after 7.30, a truck driver was flagged down to render eight. The police were called and quickly arrived on what scene. What kind of payoff is that? The survivors are part of a film crew, Lonnet Entertainment, the team behind the Architects of Murder docuseries. Fuck, man. It seems like as though they got a little too close to their subject material. And some of them, sadly, did not survive. Thankfully, their Thank ordeal is now goodness. at an end. Holy shit. Remember how my video went wow. viral? How could we forget? You bring it up every chance you get. Just listen to this. I got enough views to win a competition. What did you win? An all expense pay trip to an island resort no. for mine. My... Now I'm interested. Yeah, Mr. Dumet says they're gonna send a limo and everything. This is gonna be so much fun. But it doesn't even look like that when you get there. Wow. <laughs> and he's in the window. <laughs> this rogue rate said we will not be playing. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Yo. But wouldn't they like, so what did he just choose a different location? Probably. Like, Hang on. Oh, 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 Won't you spare me over to another? Is it a real alpha oh, play? What is this? I cannot see with I see hands. Is it copyright? Are you serious? Yeah, I said turn it off. Can they? Can they stop with the copyright music in the game that they know everybody's gonna stream? Bruh. Yeah, Should they said this is pretty famous. Um. Um Okay, they said there's something after the credits somebody said so yeah. we're going to let the credits roll. A few people said to to watch after the credits as well. Okay. Saying, yeah. I'll put it back once the credits is um Okay. You know what? Whatever. Let, let the credits roll. All right. So, my opinion of this, this is this is actually the the worst one out of the games from the the dark picture series like i don't it had the least it had the least amount of polish on it i thought that they would have like i thought everything would have been on point like since house of ashes house of ashes was dope i actually really enjoyed that one and in the other games i feel like whenever we <laughs> died or anything please delete this whole game from your life i feel like when you died it was like warranted it was like oh okay well i messed that up and this one it was like i can't think of a valid death the death scenarios were just so wild and the deaths okay the way they set up the deaths it was like other characters controlling the deaths of other characters it's not it's not how people want to play the yeah, game charlie's that's very annoying valid. charlie's death was well valid. charlie yeah that was the only one all the other ones was garbage I was like, yeah. But to be fair, we didn't know if Charlie was his if his death later would have been dictated by a different ca character because I killed him during a QT, so that was a little bit different. Uh, yeah, I don't know. And then Mark is literally the worst character in the whole game. His segments were so bad; it was so boring. I was bored out of my mind playing as Mark. Like there was nothing for him to do. 
They said this game is up there with Roshi Oni episode one of Cory in the house permanently for $1.99. <laughs> Yo, why do you remember that? Why do you even remember that? that? It was too, way too many forced dilemmas. Like Saw, but less gory and more frustrating. They said the other characters killing other characters has been in every yes, game. Yes, Justin Noob, it's been in every game, but I felt like it was like ridiculous. And in the other games, you have way more than five characters. That, and I think you have more hints to what you yeah. can do to save them. The, the quarry is like their magnum opus. It made us actually play the game twice because it was so good and so detailed and everything was fair and true. Hang on. Skip to the end. Hang on. Let's see what's up. This is Commander Stafford, the forward reconnaissance vessel in Cassiopeia. After successfully rendezvousing with a Charybdis marker, we have detached the booster ring and spreads are high as we make our final approach to Tau City F. The ship has suffered a hull impact, but damage is minimal, is and our technicians yeah. are restoring full functionality. This is Thomas Carter. Something's wrong with Sims. She's trying to kill me. Uh, I think. And that's why he said, "I'll see you again in the future." Our next transmission will be broadcast from orbit around humanity's future home. Staff it out. Directive eighty twenty. So is that going to be next year or are they going to take a couple of years to make that? Yeah, because you made me walk the farthest. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> is that it? Wow. So... <laughs> years they need some time they should they should take like two years to put that one out like don't don't drop it next year like take the time that they need so basically it's gonna be dead space even though they were in murder hotel i didn't feel the suspense they said that, i was a slasher <laughs> that was a that was another problem that i had the, with the game the editing was way off like the way certain scenes were edited and cut together it was just kind of like what and then we have that massive plot hole about how um jamie told aaron what to do but she was with charlie or that was before she linked up with charlie so what was going on there what happened that's literally a major plot point in the game that that's just like it tricks it tricks people into thinking that it's fake because you're like okay well was that a fake voice like like it could have been a fake voice because we saw that he doctored, um, he doctored Charlie's but voice. But it wasn't a fake voice. But they said, but people were saying in the director's cut, like in the director's cut, they explain what happened. Like no, put that in the actual game. Okay, so the killer was the cop. Okay, so that's what we said. Hector Monday. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. It was obvious. Yeah, and I thought that that was also easy to figure out that the killer was the cop. Missing scenes happen simultaneously in co-op. But Hanif. But Hanif, okay. That doesn't make any sense, Hanif. The reason why that doesn't make any sense is because everybody was still alive when that happened. Yeah. Literally everybody was still alive when that happened. Aaron is in the room. We hear a voice. It's Jamie. She's like, yo, go hide in the cabinet. And then I'm like, yo, that's fake. Like, that's weird. And then Cheryl was like, well, let's just listen to it. And she goes and hides. And then we go back to Jamie and it's never touched on. And then she just meets up with Charlie and they never touch on it. So it literally does not happen in the game. There's a curator's cut. They said, I have a small theor theory that the curator cheated and that's why the doors were banging at the end. 
Wait, what do you mean door? I don't know what doors you're talking about, Cameron. Oh, at the end of the game, the narrator, like when he was sitting down and then like the doors were like slamming and stuff. Yeah. I saw it on a stream. Jamie makes that decision on co-op. How, but Hanif, how is that even possible? You can literally watch our playthrough. It does not happen at all in, in our playthrough. I believe there's two killers. That's partly what I was thinking too, that there was two people because he was like everywhere at once. They said, but I believe there's two killers because here's my reasoning. There's a scene where Jamie runs as bait and Aaron and Kate trapped the killer, but he got stuck. Oh my God, focus on the curator. Wait, N New Orleans, what are you saying? New Orleans is saying focus on the curator. Focus on the curator for what? He was changing things. Hmm. Online co-op, not movie mode. Okay. Online co-op is different from just past the controller. That's fucking dumb. Yeah, they said the, the... I do think the killer had remotes for the doors because when we were looking at all the blueprints and everything, one of the things was in there was remotes. So that I don't question as far as who was controlling the doors. I think the killer was controlling the doors because he had remote. Okay, and the killer's name wasn't crossed out. Dumet. Yeah. I think it was purely executed game-wise, but I think the curator was messing with the hints. Okay. But there were no good hints, really. That's that's interesting. That's an interesting concept. Uh, okay, online co-op where you play at the same time, you can play as Jamie helping Aaron. Why would you separate the experience like that? That's so strange. Okay. Yeah, I did see somebody say that. Like, that's why Jamie gets so much screen time because if Aaron lives, Aaron and Jamie get most of the screen time together. Mm. But Aaron is a hard character to keep alive. So I feel like, is that really valid? Because if she's such an easy character to kill, then why would you give her the most screen time? Okay, so here's what I'll say. That's very, okay. If the curator is messing with the story and the hints and that's why stuff doesn't make sense and then there's plot holes and he's kind of controlling stuff, like, excuse me, then I get it, right? That's cool. It just wasn't executed well. The game was not executed well. Hmm. Okay. Kate and Jamie get the most screen time out of anyone. Charlie is third. Aaron barely gets any decision making. The curator says in the game he's only supposed to observe and at the end he doesn't cross off a name and rips it out angrily. And I think he's in trouble with his bosses. And is that why he said he'll finish up the paperwork in the morning? Okay. Interesting. Okay. Well, listen, there's only so much that we could do. I think I don't, I, I'm not going to give this game a run back. I'm going to be completely honest. Like this is the first one that we've played where I was like actually disappointed by the end of it. Like I wanted us to kill the killer. Like after all of that work and like all of that fighting back. And then it's like he still lived like that was, I think it's, it's always upsetting. Like when it's so easy to kill the characters, but then like the killer doesn't die. It's like, give us some payoff. Like we worked so hard <laughs> to get away from this man, like, and not die. And then we got away and we didn't die. And then he's yeah. still alive. Like there's no payoff for that. It was like, it was all for nothing. And yeah. then now he's going to keep on killing people. 
It sucks, but this game isn't about those characters, just the curator. Hmm. Like, and then it was sad, like, you know, obviously seeing the guy's body um, with the little girl, with the blanket over them, like, that was sad. And what was the, um, what was the ferryman thing on? I think you were right when you said that they were going to make him the ferryman. But then he still took the other dude out. Huh. With the little girl, he still took him out. So unless he lied to him and said, oh, if you bring five people back, I'll clap you. But like he still invited five other people some other way. I'm pretty sure Jamie and Mark didn't go tell these five people to go over there. Brown Mamba, do you you see when Dumet dies, you see when he dies or the guy that D- Dumet it wasn't really Dumet, it was Joseph Morello or whatever. You see when he dies, you kill him with the scythe. When Charlie was standing on the platform and then he backs away and then the scythe goes and stabs him. And yes, you only see the curator two times for like a total of yeah. 60 seconds. I, do, I was going to comment on that as well. You don't really see the curator at all during this game. Okay, yes. Somebody said you're right. He doesn't let the ferryman live. He betrays them. Okay, so that that is what that is. Like he Yeah. Okay, he makes he strikes a deal with the ferryman. Thanks for the dono forces. I know Thank I'm late you. to party well support. Thank you so much for the support. Dude stayed up till one AM for this. They messed this game up. I wish it was better, man. But you know, it is what it is. Everything can't be a winner. You know, I'll still play the next one and, you know, hopefully they come back strong. But this was definitely at the bottom of the four for me. So, okay. Yeah, they said there is an ending where Mark and Jamie make a deal. I missed it. Where? Where'd you see it? On Twitch or was it on On YouTube? On Twitch. Um... There's anyone, anyway, Mark and Jamie make a deal, bruh. Yeah. See, bruh, see why can't struggle? I never pause the Twitch chat? You see my struggle. Whoever said that that thing about the... Yeah, there's an email where Mark He delivers deal. five people and Dumet straight snipes them when they're leaving. <laughs> wow. Okay. All right. It's late. I'm going to bed. Thank you to everybody who came here and watched us play this. Uh, watch us fumble. Watch everybody pretty much die in the game. You donated. You hung out. You dropped some subs. We appreciate it. Um, that is going to be a wrap for Devil and Me. Here's the plan going forward. I'm still trying to platinum God of War. I haven't played since the last stream. But I, only, I only play when I stream. So I'll be back to that. Either tomorrow or Monday. Um, and then after that, we're going to be playing Callisto Protocol. So I hope you guys pull up for that. That's That should be a movie. That's going to be some fun. Callisto protocol. So, okay. With that, we're going to wrap. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of your weekend and we'll catch you guys next time. Peace out. Peace.